Sport. I'm Ida Warenga. And TV Sport continues its coverage of the state of sports infrastructure in Kenya. Tonight, we turn the spotlight on Kakamega County, specifically one of the country's oldest stadiums, Buhungu. Its recent refurbishment changed the face of the county. And as the following report shows, there's more to come. This map of land. The revamp of Kakamega County's Buhungu Stadium in 2017 put the facility on the regional map after it hosted the Sakafa Senior Challenge Cup in the same year. The three-phase upgrade continues after the initial stage saw the fitting of modern seats, a media center, administration center, touch-up of the pitch and 13 entry and exit points amongst other features. Uh, to rebuild actually. Uh, Buhungo Stadium and we are building it, we have finished first phase, spent 500 million, we are now going to, uh, to spend another 2.5 billion. The final phase will see the upgrade of the seating to accommodate 25,000 spectators, construction of a swimming pool and anti-doping room amongst other things. The duration of construction, 170 weeks, we handed over the, the site for, to, to the contractor on 18th of September. The stadium, which once hosted bullfighting sessions, is home to Kenyan Premier League club Kakamega Homeboys. For me, I consider Buhungu Stadium as an international stadium. That is why I came up with the name Camp Mega Stadium. You know, stadiums in, uh, let's say in Spain, like Camp Nou. Western Kenya is a sports powerhouse in the country, producing talent across various disciplines, such as the late 3,000 meter steeplechase Olympic silver medalist Ben Gipcho and volleyball legend Dorcas Desaba, amongst many others. Renowned footballers like Jonathan Liva, uh, Kadenge, uh, JJ Masika, Murilla, eh? uh, Elijah Ridonde, whom they say. That he kicked the ball until it, is, it uh, uh, disappeared in the sky.